every once in a while before I get on stage, I'll be standing in the corner and I'm prepared, I'm set, I'm ready to go. Mentally I'm prepared, I know, my, I know what I'm gonna say, I'm ready, I'm over here and I'm, I've got a good attitude towards this, don't I? This is what I love to do. And someone will come up to me and they'll say, Matt, are you ready? I'm so ready, we're gonna kill him. This is gonna be awesome. She, she'll say, I want you to be careful because our last speaker tripped on that power cord, that orange power cord right on the stage. Up until that time, did I see the power cord? But she said, don't trip over the power cord. All of a sudden, what happens to my attitude towards this presentation? So I'm standing on the side and I'm saying, this presentation's gonna be great, this is gonna be good, as long as I don't trip over the power cord. And then I start saying it. This is it. Don't trip over the power cord. Don't trip over the power cord. Somebody comes up to give me a bottle of water. Matt, are you ready? I say, I'm ready as long as I don't trip over the power cord. What do you think I'm going to do when I come up on stage? There's a pretty good chance I'm going to trip on the orange power cord, isn't there? See, the attitude that you have towards something determines what you think about. What you think about all the time determines what you talk about, and what you talk about eventually happens.